Hello, my friends. Welcome back to the CD Junkie. My name is Aiden, and I'm excited for a number of reasons. And one of them, of course, is this incredible blue lipstick that you are seeing. In case you're worried, it's not some profound cyanosis that I'm suffering. This is my latest purchase from Manic Panic, and I love them. I'm not paid to shill for them, but I should be because um, they're the best. And I feel like I talk them up all the time for nothing. So, you know, Manic Panic, if you're out there, I have a channel with like six followers and um, I think I could be a great fit for you. So hashtag hook a girl up. Okay, enough of that. If you're new here, welcome to CD Junkie. What we do is I pull out stuff from my music collection and I talk about why I like it and that's it. And hopefully you listen and you enjoy it. And maybe if you even feel like it, you can talk back to me, leave me a comment, show me a picture of your stuff. I, I like to talk. Anyway, enough of that. Enough about me. I'm not here to talk about me. I'm here to talk to you about meatloaf. Not the comfort food. The Canadian, I believe he's Canadian, singer, actor, mountainous creation of the heavens. I don't know, meatloaf is like, it's like a god crafted from brow sweat and mullets. It's amazing. Anyway, I want to talk to you about Bad Out of Hell. Not Bad Out of Hell 1. Everybody knows Bad Out of Hell 1. Everyone knows it's fantastic. Bad Out of Hell. But 2 out of 3 ain't bad. All of it. It's all great. I'm not here to talk to you about Bad Out of Hell 2. Everybody knows Bad Out of Hell 2, right? Anything for love. It's great. We know this is great. I'm not here to talk to you about that. I'm here to talk to you about Bat Out of Hell 3. Bat Out of Hell 3. Now, if you're like me, you didn't realize that there were three bats loose from hell, but there are. There are three bats missing in hell and they've been turned loose on this world by meatloaf. I'm not going to sit here and tell you that this is as good as one or two, but this is, it's good. It's fun to listen to. I found this at, I think maybe my local half price books and I paid $4.99 for it, and that's a steal all day for meatloaf. Listen, I don't care. I, I do not care what anyone thinks, clearly. I, I love meatloaf. I'm a meatloaf fan. Anybody who wants to get in here, challenge me on whether or not meatloaf is fucking awesome. I'll fight you. I will fight you right now. I will punch you over meatloaf. Anyway, this thing is great. I picked it up. It was a surprise. I didn't um, know what I was looking for, but I just dug around. And this has some really good tracks on it. It has the Monsters loose. That's the first cut. That's worth your time. Um, in the land of the pig, the butcher is king. Forget about it. Forget about it. That's worth it for the title. That was worth $4.99 for the title. So anyway, treasures everywhere. Half Price Books is always worth your time. And if you thought that you had seen or heard all of the Stygian bats that were flying about, you're incorrect. There's three of them, at least. 